All right, what's up, everybody? This is J.D. Olson with Kishi Dojo Martial Arts Release and the Martial Arts Limited Association. And today, we're going to go ahead and show you the grappling class with the, uh, with the dummy. We're going to use the Motion Master. If you have a body pillow or a couch cushion, like one of the back couch cushions, you can use one of those at home, too, to do all these drills. All right? Stay tuned. And so what I'm going to practice right now is what we call the swaying base drill. So I'm facing the feet, I mean the head, sorry. I use this pass to signify the head. So I face there, I'm going to scissor my feet so I'm in the cross mount position with my feet nice and wide. And then I step where my feet are now facing the dragon wall or the feet of the character. And so now I scissor and I switch back. Okay? I want you to do 10 of these every time you face the same direction, you get is one. So to look at that right now, I'm here. That's one. And that's two. Be careful uh, with this here. You don't want both feet kind of forward. You want to make sure you have a wide base so you don't get pushed over when you actually are grappling. You don't want it to be lazy, okay? And when I'm here, I keep all my weight. So one of the things we were practicing yesterday was trying to do this no hands. So you're here, here, here to keep your chest on them. So knock out 10 per side, okay? So once you're here, you can hop over. And now I'm facing this side here and I sway my base and I sway my base. It shouldn't be any different but because you're initiating your hips on the other side towards the head, it does feel a little different. All right, knock out those 10 per side, and then come back and we'll give you the next move. All right, you got your first 10 done of the swaying base drill. Now we're gonna talk about the step over, okay? A step over and a back step. I'm gonna start, again, I'm in that cross body position. You're gonna scissor, and my knee is touching their body. And at this point, you can simulate pulling the leg and you step right over into mount. And now I'm going to back step, aka dismount, to get to the other side. So my arm's going to come across, elbow drops, my hip steps, and I have a nice wide step for my back step. And now I'm just going to simply go side to side. So that'll be one. Two, notice how wide I am. And three. Knock out 10 of those on the pillow or whatever it is you're using. And then we'll go ahead to the next video or next thing. Excellent. Now the mission is to take those two and put them together. So I'm starting in my Kazura Case Katami. I am under the arm for this initial drill. I sway my base. I step over. I dismount with the back step. Sway my base, face the head. Sway your base. Step over. Dismount. And sway your base. That's one. Sway your base. Step over. Dismount. Sway your base. One more time. Sway your base. Step over. Back step. Sway your base. And that'll be two. All the way to ten. It's going to take a bit of time. You should be noticing a pretty good workout by now as well. Oh, awesome. So, at this point now, we're going to hop over. Okay? I'm going to be here in this position like this. I'm going to scoop my butt. Till it's touching the their hip or the, the corner of the, uh, the bag you're practicing on. This arm comes underneath, hop over, okay? And then I scoop myself back to make sure I'm touching. Hop over, hop over. Try to control your descent. Don't just smash your knees, your feet, or don't land on your guy. Because when you do this with a real person, they won't like you. So I'm here, I'm here. I scoop my butt back, and I try to go right back into my side monitor, my Kazura Kazuki Every time you come to the same side, that'll be one. 
That'll be 10 of those. is gonna be the helicopter pass. You can do this either direction. I initially teach it, just like Professor Eric taught it to us, towards the feet. So, I'm gonna sway my base. Now, I'm gonna post on my far hand and my leg, and I'm gonna come up, and I'm gonna pull the legs up, and then I'm gonna dismount. Again, get that wide base. Hand's gonna post. Helicopter pass over, pull the legs, dismount, post, post, up, here, and down, post, post, up, here, and down. Just like every drill, 10 of them every time you get to the same side is one. Awesome. Well, there you have all of our initial dummy drills that I want you to start with. Um, if you're having a hard time, go ahead and let us know. Also, if you're struggling with any of them, train them a little longer. Or ask any questions, let us know what we can do to help. Other than that, we'll see you in the next video. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel so you can see all the videos. Also, hit that bell so you're notified whenever a new video is posted. During this whole CV19, we're going to be posting a ton of videos. So all of this is for your home training to keep you going while the whole quarantine and if anything gets any worse, we'll keep you posted. Also. Check out other videos in the Martial Element Association YouTube channel because we have a whole slew of Kali as well as some grappling ones, even some Aikido and some other fun stuff. And finally, if you haven't already, you should check out the Martial Element Association actual uh, page, which is themaua.com because the entire curriculum for most of the systems is already online to include TFC. A lot of the Kali is already up. 